We've got a game-changing story in entertainment today. Crouching Tiger Hidden Dragon is getting a sequel, but here's the kicker. It's going to be on Netflix. Yes, a very big deal because the streaming video service has done a deal with the Weinstein Company that will bring their first foray into the feature film business onto IMAX screens in select theaters and on Netflix next August. Now, some theater groups in the States are already crying foul about this because they don't like the idea of a online and uh, by mail streaming service getting into the movie business, but this just shows the changing face of Hollywood today. The Crouching Tiger sequel on Netflix. Look for that next summer. All right, the Vancouver International Film Fest is in full swing, and we need to tell you about this wonderful film that screened last night, the Vancouver Asahi, and this tells the, story, the story of 1930s Japantown in Vancouver when a group of Canadian-born kids launched their own baseball team. The movie was actually shot in Tokyo uh, in a soundstage uh, with a back lot that was made to look like Vancouver in the 30s. There was a huge crowd on hand there. Uh, before the big show and uh, much acclaim on the red carpet. And finally, over the weekend, Michael Buble stopped by Burnaby and he visited the local detachment there of the RCMP, taking a little break and taking advantage uh, of the open house that the RCMP were staging and had some time to pose for some photos, guys. Love that, going down to his hometown roots. Something that never changed about Mike. He never forgets the little things the when roots. he comes home. Yeah.